Down. I think I pooed. <laughs> I've got deadlifting stones today, so it's kind of my last, probably my last deadlifting stone session, so. Uh, just play it by ear. I'd like to do something heavy-ish. But you know, I'm not, <coughs> still fighting this friggin' bug off, so. Just whatever my body allows. Because then I've got like, 10 days where I just need to try and get well. You know, got some antibiotics, so you're not really meant to train heavy on antibiotics, so start them after today. Hopefully I'll clean up in time for Europe's. Yeah, it's been a pretty rough ride. I've had this about three weeks now. Uh, it's just, uh, it's absolutely kicking the backside out of me. It's never nice being in, is it? No, no, but normal circumstances is if you're not well, you rest, but I kind of don't really have that joy. It's like I either rest or I train. I've got a comp to, comps to train for, but the sessions are just so difficult. But, you know, at least if I go in and I've tried to train for it, it is what it is. Uh, yeah, it's probably like, I don't know. I don't want to say it on camera, but yeah, I've been bad for a few weeks now and it's just not going anywhere. Loads of phlegm on my chest, can't breathe properly. Every time I try to do like loading or conings the past two weeks, I just can't do it. Even walking on the treadmill is quite tough. So I'm just trying to keep my strength up and then hopefully that'll clear in time uh, for shows. You know, because I can't, I can't do them, so. It's frustrating, but my body weight's still low. It's like still like 150, so I'm not uh, I'm not exactly getting fat while I'm not doing my cardio. So yeah, but I'd like to do heavy deadlift. I'm not going to say any numbers. We'll just see how the day goes. But maybe a heavy triple, heavy triple would be nice. I thought they were trying to put some dodgy music on while I was talking. Giving my uh, gum shield a clean. Oh, God, that's floating around in there. Oh, yeah. could it? Chris, I'll give you a tenner to drink it. Yeah. What is it? It's off my mouth, what? So. My mouth guard. Oh, what the tenor. fuck? Can <laughs> <laughs> you see it? Can you see it? Yeah, it looks you see it all? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get 100 miles of fuel for a tenner. <laughs> 12 then. <laughs> okay. But if you drink it, it makes you as strong as Graham. No. No? I'm alright. Wouldn't you? I'll drink it. <laughs> <laughs> it makes you your own. Well, it make me stronger. Even if it did make you stronger, I still wouldn't. Have this and I'll start warming up. <laughs> I hate it when he drips sweat on me. I'm not going to drink that. It's <laughs> 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 always got a drip on his nose, and I'm like, wipe it. <laughs> I don't know what you're about. What you're about? Yeah. I've got kids. I was going to say, you can't help it. I can't help being ill. And, like, you know, I speak to the strong men who are sleeping 12, 13 hours a night, napping in the day. You'll get over it a lot quicker. I don't have that luxury. <laughs> Even if I tried to sleep 13 hours a night, I wouldn't be able to. Just can't. Just can't. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's just not shifting. And what's happening is I'll come in and do a, I'll push a session and I think it's setting me back. So I did that heavy log two days ago and I was rough as hell yesterday. And then today I feel a little bit better, and then tomorrow I'll probably be on the backside again. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. 
I'll tell you about last week when I came in on Tuesday. I came in on Tuesday, I put that on the bar, came into the toilet, and I literally just stood here like that. And when I went, and I just got stuck. I was like, I grabbed this thing, and I was like, oh. Something just fucking like went in my back, and then I was me for all day. I was trying to pass her 100 kilos, I had to put my belt on. I was scared. <laughs> But then I came in on Wednesday and did like a light deadlift session with no pro no problem. So I don't know what the hell it was. Good morning. Welcome. You all right? Yeah, good. Just had an absolute nightmare on the motorway there. You're joking. Where's the toilet? Hey, mate, you all right? Oh, you're all right. Yeah, you go out here and turn right. It's like a disabled toilet. You called, mate? Eh, uh, no, I just took the kids off at school this morning. I just fucking cut the ass taking it off. Yeah, fucking pissing down here. I've got a Halo tablet. You got uh, Halo? Uh, I'm going to do my deads and then have it and see if it perks me up for stone. I had my gum shield in, look. I'll put your gum shield in. Oh, Doesn't go fit. I was like, what's all that? Gums and plaque. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's go. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> I come to, I come to Strongman from bodybuilding, so I think I'm a bit genius about the politics. We've got as much politics, but there's just as much bitch. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. The bad these at Wilson, aren't they? Oh, I know. Not long. Bad what? The figure eights, right? Yeah. Uh, Ford Darren said. Uh, Apparently it's something to do with like, the medical staff and stuff like that, they don't want to do Why? Do you know like Cause... someone passes out or faints or whatever and they're stuck in it? Yeah. Is that because the wife and the bitch? Yeah, basically that sort of stuff. Giants still allowing them, but they're not allowed at world, no matter. But I definitely know they're not allowed to ship. Okay. I reckon Bibi's going to get one. No, you've been doing a bit of stuff on him. Bibi. I think so. Just saw a video of him doing some loading saying try to get in shape, hashtag 2023. I'm like, he's got to be getting in shape for something. Yeah. See the band figure eight? Yeah, it's been on about it there. Yeah, yeah. Do you know that bit annoys me? I haven't really done it with much time left, have we? Yeah, it's probably the best thing to be doing it on. It doesn't move, does it? 
doesn't roll. Very good. Did you watch it back? Was that in it? Yeah. <laughs> How much do you weigh? 133 at the moment. 133? Yeah. I got body dysmorphia or something. Do they still look good? <laughs> What's that? He's even trying it. He doesn't wake up till he gets got a floor in front of it. I've got some guy that fucking... He's got, I told him, I said, I fucking see you in person, I'm going to shove an atlas stone up your ass. <laughs> and he said, yes, please. He keeps going on Kim's videos and saying... Um, what did you do when you found Hixie in Oh, lovely. No, but the best thing it, is, he's like, no, I heard it from Loz. Yeah, and then it's all, Colin and Colin said it, oh, and Terry, and I'm like, no, they didn't. Because I actually fucking asked them, and they know who you are. They all say you're a dick. Uh, and then I do a log, you'll see it on my one nighty log. He's like, lockout was, uh, you didn't lock it out. Um, Colin Bryce has already said you've got issues, as of others, and I'm stood there with it for five seconds above my head, <laughs> locked out. What's going on over there? What the fuck is going on over there? <laughs> Where's my phone? <laughs> we do a, we do a twelve. I'm not sure. lid though, I can't fucking I can't smell the actual thing. You take Halo, do you? Oh, <laughs> <coughs> I've got two on that because they don't fit me properly. Ah. One's 58, one's 56. When I'm a bit bigger, my 58 fits nice. But because I've lost weight, even my 56 don't fit. Well, it's too loose? Yeah. What are you in at the moment? But I had a, it, they're all different, person to person. Mind you, because I've got little skinny fucking legs. And I when I did that team show, I had my 58 on and my deadlift felt completely crazy. 
but I was big. Mm. I was like 160. That's a 60, but it doesn't look anywhere near as big as that. No, mine are they're big, mate. Yeah, I don't. I have a 60 next door. It's enormous. They don't. They just don't. They're not same suit to suit. Really. No. Always. I wasn't sure how it would feel, but yeah, it felt like. It's right what he says, it's like taking it in every I wake up a bit. The 270 is the one I always have to be like, right, wake up now, because it's, it's the one that can always <coughs> pull me out if I'm, if I'm not pulling properly. Buzzing, I got it to the top and just dropped it and went, yeah! <laughs> oh dear. Okay, hell, man. It's just finding the line again. Like, I'm still sort of like finding out where my body is. The whip was putting me off a little bit there. It's just weird. Oh, let's just find out where I am. Yeah. Alright, soon. I'll get that back up. Well done. What's your body weight at the moment? 90. 90, back, back down, yeah. 90. So, but it's like, what's that? 17 kilo dropped in eight weeks. Go on, Yeah, it feels good to me. That's why I think I'm gonna have probably just do a triple on something. So obviously even with suit on I'm like 
And I struggle with, uh, I get claustrophobic really easy. So I can't breathe. I've got to try and chill at the same time before I do a big do it lift. For the so, but it's going all right. I'll probably go 360 next, see speed on that, and then decide. Uh, but it felt good. I dare say it's probably felt best it's been in weeks. So, um, the session you were up last, I did 355, didn't I? I don't feel like my warm ups before that were as quick as this. So, we'll see. I know my strength's good, so. I'll pull 360 and then. And then I'll decide. Come on, let's go! Come on, Nick. It's going, it's going, let's go! Come on! Yes, yes, yes! Commit, Come commit! Come on! Oh, shame. You got the pop. Good shot, mate. Right. How many athletes you got competing in the next few? You got Europe's and Worlds, haven't you? Got Gav and Gav's at Worlds. Got Par and Gav at Europe's. Then we've got Ben doing the England's qualifiers. Lewis Jack doing the Scotland's strongest man and UK's strongest man. Those are like the main sort of info guys I've got on at the moment. So we're doing for that. Often Par gets the Worlds. What about the lovely ladies? Eh? So what about the lovely ladies? I don't have that many ladies on at the moment, mate. Don't you? No, I did. Uh, and a couple of national champions on. But at the moment, it's just mostly male clients. I've got uh, a lady from Wales on. Uh, I've, got, I've got a few down the gym as well. But it's starting to really boot off the strong woman side of things, so we'll look at more in the future. I thought you did, uh, I thought you did Donna Moore. No, I mean Donna were just mates. Oh. We're just pals. I watched that documentary thing on her. Yeah. The Don Don Strong, and obviously you were on it. Yeah, me and Donna, basically, when I first started doing Strongman, um, there used to be a guy from my area called Gary Gardner, and that's where me and Donna both started training Strongman in the Carrick Garrison gym. Oh, so okay. that's how we know Donna, basically, we both started doing Strongman together in this little shed on uh, Carrick Garrison. Okay. So we've been like mates ever since, been up in America a few times together, and that's on the gym. Yeah, the court. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely. Nice. You do me a favour, Dad. You grab me two rogues, reds. Eee. I'll grab one. I'll just be a one each. I'm not strong enough. No, I'm, I'm in that weird stage where my body doesn't know which way it wants to lift anything. Do you know, from yeah. the side, if you watch it from the side, it comes off the deck really well, but then it feel, look like it come away from you. So that's why I started going wide on my stance, because my line sit was getting back. better. Yeah, yeah. Because I could sit back into it, and like, but now I have to go back to it, it's like re relearning it again. Because I've always had that problem, even with like any weight. I find as I get to there, yeah, I it straighten was, my it, legs a bit too yeah, much. It, it come goes away back from and I've got to get back to it. Yeah. And that, that's like a really bad technical so difficulty I've got. Go I think I pooed. Fucking hell. 
Yeah, you've got to check on that. I'm not touching that one. I'll help you. Pleasantly surprised. Um, I pulled one. And it moved well, I thought it would move well. And then I pulled two. And my eyes lit up, I thought, oh God, I've got three. And then Kim shouts another one. I did four and I, I never really programmed myself to do four reps on anything. So I was like, I'm going to do five. PB really, I've only ever pulled, I know I've pulled like 420 for three, 400 for three, but my, my highest five, I'd want to say is, 370 for five maybe you know and I'm, obviously I'm significantly lighter than my Cardiff prep was so it's nice to see that my deadlift strength's coming back um, but I still feel like crap <laughs> so uh, do some stones now um, again just play around I'm quite happy really where my strength is just tickle stones now and then focus on the next 10 days on trying to get this chest cleared so I can breathe properly. Uh, it's not been nice, I mean. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's how you get stronger. Yeah. yeah. You, you've got to rest, you know. It's not CrossFit, you got to do CrossFit, you got to do CrossFit. <laughs> do, you see, do you see Brian's videos? Yeah. He kept laughing at me because I kept going find the chair. <laughs> See you then. He's like, I'm like, I sit down. He's like, you're lazy. I went, no, I'm resting. Yeah. I'll get up when I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah, Brian loves it. He's like, he's like loading bar up, Dale. And we had like, I think it was two, 240 plus on thing. And I'm sat there and I'm like, not even got my wraps on. And he's like, are you ready to go? I was like, yeah, go on then. So I get up and he's like shaking his head at me. I went, what? He went, are you going to get revved up for this? I went, I'll get revved up when I sit down. <laughs> Even Darren says it now, he was sit down. You know you just freaking take all day. Yeah, I've got this thing where like, what time are you going to be here? At Hicksy time. I'm like, you know about? Yeah, can you get here before five? Was I, I must have been late at some point. And then it's just some stuck. Point, all the time. Yeah. Uh, well, I've had to heat, been heating that up or using the cold weather spider, but then it's been getting too warm for the cold weather. It's been having a nightmare. Yeah, I can imagine. Right, so here's a tip. I get asked this a few times actually. It's a lot of my clients say this as well. How do you put tacky on? So it's not a a dab. You've got to rub it in. Almost create a paste. Like it's the same on the hands, but it's easier to do on the hands, obviously. So when it's on the hands, it's just easy to just put your hands together. Do it like that. You're just creating a paste all the time. Not dot 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 dot. You need to rub it in. So, takes a few minutes to sort. Then you're good to go. Do you re-tack here after every, every round? Not really, it's just that some of the some of my lighter stones uh, I tend to lose my tacky just because various reasons other people have put other tacky on it they're a bit more shit up yeah. um, but like I, I'm only, I mainly re my hands because I didn't put a lot on to start with um, they're alright just keep trying to put a bit more on my hands each time. Uh, but if, I, if I'm emotionally 160 comfortably, I normally go place. No, you can have a look at that. Is it the heavier set of uh, Europe's? Light set. Well, I guess, yeah. The thing is, if this feels really good and my tacky feels really good, I might try the 180 again. Uh, 
So I've managed to do it and not been happy with my tacky. I've got the 200 out last week. Felix was the only one that could do it because he doesn't rely on tacky like I do. He's got more purchase. Which makes him a very fucking dangerous stone if that. You know, if my tacky fails, I'm calm. I'm a bit effed. Whereas he's fine. You actually watch him before he does a rub, or before he does any he doesn't put a lot on anyway. He puts a little bit on his hands and he just puts a little bit on there. He never puts a lot on. He, like I say, he doesn't need to, he's got such a good purchase. He, uh, like for me, it's like almost, I'm, I'm picking it up like that, whereas he's grabbing it and picking it up like that. I mean, even the bigger one, he's still doing that. Today I'm, like, I'm like that, so I need the stick to be able to lift it because I can't get my arms around. It's been really cold in here the last few weeks. What, what grade of tacky do you use? I like spider, you see. I've got light, comp, and heavy. Yeah. And light, obviously, is good for winter. But then we, we've been having heaters on. We've got a temperature thing over there. And when it floats at around 10 degrees, I almost don't have one that's good enough. I've got the Cerberus stuff. Yeah. But I stick, try to stick with the spider. Yeah, yeah. Today it's 17 in here. Was it? So it's a competition one. I can get my fingers in it. Yeah, yeah. I normally have like whatever grade's right for the temperature and then I'll put a blob of the grade below so that you know if you need to top up yeah, there's yeah. no having to push it in you can literally just drag it down because yeah, it's yeah, like, it's more malleable isn't it so yeah, like I, last week when I did stones I did a grade two on my arms and a grade one and as soon as I got to the last stone I just dragged it down yeah, yeah, yeah. well I always usually I prep the stone so yeah it's ready for me like yeah. thing around there Right, sir. About 60? 40. You can't tell me on a storm and you can't do 180 in one motion, mate. Like Be fair. Balls are too small, obviously. Don't believe me for one second.
exactly left six is <laughs> Well, I am going to go and lie down because <laughs> that was a good session. Very unexpected. Good. Regardless of what happens in Europe, I'm just going to go out and have fun. You know, I can't help being sick. It's absolutely made this prep ridiculous. Um, but yeah, I just want to try and get get my body in a good way so I can go and enjoy it better. Uh, yeah, the storms were good. I managed to do 181 motion again. Um, I was doing 160 in one. Uh, I was going to just stop at five and then I decided, sorry, I had to finish on a triple. So I did seven in total. So it was a good little bit of work. And obviously I did twos warming up, so I've done a little bit of decent stone work there from the previous weeks, so I'm happy where my stones are and uh, exceptionally happy where my deadlift is. Um, yeah, it kind of really shocked me today. I actually had a number when I started, it was just to do 380 for three. Um, I'd have been very, very happy with that. I exceeded that by 10 kilos and two reps, so yeah, can't complain. 390 for five is a PB, um, and it's definitely a PB at this body weight as well. So everything bodes well going forward. Um, no expectations for Europe's. Should have had fun. Um, got some good events. Got some unknown events just because I'm not there to train them. Uh, but yeah, just go have fun. Um, be part of the show that's what it's all about for me so thanks for watching um hope you enjoy the video and i hope you enjoy europe's strongest man thanks guys